12 fox so might be quite inquisitively interested into as to what we were doing uh, so there was a few lines of computer codes which are running out over there and uh, the point might be are we doing some sort of computer programming machine learning image processing or say medicine over here well i'm trying to solve a uh, interesting problem on digital pathology and that's about uh, from these microscopy images i'm trying to figure out as to which of them are cancerous images and which of them are not cancerous so these are just images of your wbc in your blood and uh, captured under a microscope uh, on a staining condition so i just have a wonderful piece of code over here which we'll be reading down uh, in the next of the lecture series now what we are doing is a uh, interesting uh, point of culmination in uh, today's time and that's called as medical imaging uh, and image analysis so i'm going to teach about the specific course on medical image analysis and uh, this is an intro video which would be speaking about what we are going to do over here now uh, the most interesting part over here is that this is where we find a culmination of medical imaging physics to medicine to actually deploying systems and uh, tools and softwares which would be helping in diagnosis on a very high precision system in our future days now what we are going to do learn is uh, to solve a lot of these uh, major challenges over here and uh, to speak about a few of them which we call as grand challenges in biomedical image analysis which basically range from microscopy to mr to uh, tumor proliferation assessment to mammography to multiple sclerosis assessment to multiple of these uh, multimodal imaging challenges uh, and disease segments we are looking at an industry which is expected to be worth at about 3 and a half billion us dollars by the end of 2020 and at this particular interesting stand point of view i would be covering out on a 10 hours uh, syllab 10 hours course designed to be spanning over a period of 4 weeks in which we would be learning from cross coding assignments to linear algebra to understanding basic image processing for the purpose of medical image analysis so keep yourself tuned and uh, hope to uh, interact much more with you on a very interesting note with this